Dogs are masters at hiding pain. That's why it's up to us to check their health on a regular basis. Here are 11 simple signs that show your pooch is very healthy. And what's more, these signs are confirmed by scientists. Odor-free ears. Your pet's ear is an easy determiner that helps you know if your furry friend is healthy or not. An unhealthy dog would have ears that look rather unusual. Animal experts have also confirmed that some dogs are more prone to ear infections than others. For example, floppy-eared dogs like Cocker Spaniels, Basset Hounds, and other long-eared dogs tend to have more ear infections than dogs with upright ears. The same goes for canines that love swimming. This is because they have too much moisture trapped in their ears, leading to the formation and growth of bacteria. Your pooch might have an ear infection if she is scratching her ear or the area around her ear frequently, and if there's hair loss around the ear. Bella also needs help if she's rubbing her ear or the area that surrounds it on the floor or furniture. Odorless ears indicate that your fluffy friend's ears are in a good state. Also look for the insides to have a pale pink color and no swelling scabs or crust around. Smooth and shiny coat. This is a telltale sign that shows you whether your four-legged friend is ill or in perfect condition. A dog's coat is one of its largest sensory organs. It protects them from external objects, regulates their temperature, and also helps them maintain proper hydration. Canines with a dry, flaky, or unkempt coat may be suffering from several health conditions, some of which can prove to be quite deadly. This is why various intellectuals have written books and carried out research about our animal friend's coats. Healthy skin is flexible and smooth, without scabs, white flakes, or red areas. It ranges in color from pale pink to brown or black depending on your pet's breed. You can check your pooch for fleas, ticks, lice by blowing gently on your dog's stomach or brushing their hair backwards in a few places. Take your hound to the vet if she has dandruff, bald spots, or excessive oiliness, as this could be a symptom of kidney or liver disease, nutritional disorders, among others. Bright and shiny eyes. A healthy dog's eyes are not just bright and shiny, but the lashes also do not rub the eyeball. Various studies have also proven that dogs have three eyelids. Sometimes you can see your dog's third eyelid, a light membrane at the inside corner of an eye. According to experts at the American Kennel Club, it is normal for your furry friend to have mucus and watery tears in her eyes. However, it should be minimal and clear. Also, your dog is very healthy if the pink lining of her eyes is not inflamed, swollen, or has a yellow discharge. Here's a quick eye check that you can also perform with your pet. Hold your palm out toward your dog about 18 inches away from its face. Then move your hand swiftly forward until it is about 3 inches from your canine's face. Your dog should blink. Test each eye individually, and if there's no reaction, you should call your veterinarian. Cool and moist nose. While we humans rely primarily on our sight, canines use their sense of smell to navigate the world around them. Their nose is far better than ours. This is why your buddy likes to sniff things when you take her for a walk and use her nose to examine things rather than her eyes. To maximize their ability to gather information about their surroundings, they keep their noses wet. But this doesn't mean that a dry nose indicates that something is wrong either. It just depends on the environment. If it's a hot day, it's only normal that your pet's snout is dry. Dry noses also occur when the canine is asleep. This wet-dry cycle is because your pooch's nose is her thermoregulator. Dr. Peter Weinstein of the Southern California Veterinary Medical Association states that a dog's nose needs to be checked if there is a lump on it, if it's swollen, or if the dog is constantly sneezing. Pink gums. A healthy dog's gums are pink, black, or spotted just like the dog's skin. They are also firm, moist, and smooth to the touch. One way to check the health of your dog's gums is to press a spot on their gums with your index finger. After you let go, within about two seconds, the color should change from a white or pale pink back to pink. A dog whose gums are dark red and swollen may have an infection that could lead to gingivitis or periodontitis. To prevent this, your dog will need your help with dental care. Depending on the breed, puppies have 23 baby teeth and adult dogs have roughly 42 permanent teeth. 
Young dogs also have smooth white teeth that tend to darken with age. Brushing your pooch's teeth three times a week will help remove plaque and prevent tartar accumulation. Once it's part of her daily routine, Bella will begin to expect and also enjoy it. Temperature just like in every human, your fur baby's temperature is a sign that she is healthy or not. To check your dog's temperature, you can use a rectal thermometer. You will need to put some petroleum jelly on the bulb of the thermometer. Then have someone that your pet is comfortable with hold her head while you lift her tail and insert the thermometer about an inch into her rectum. Dr. Amy Flowers, a professional veterinarian, explains that a dog's normal temperature is 101 to 102.5 degrees Fahrenheit. If her temperature reaches 103 degrees or higher, your furry friend has a fever. Take your dog to the vet immediately, as this is a cry for help. A temperature of 106 degrees or greater can harm or kill a pet's internal organs, so don't wait until it reaches that level. Color and form of excretions. Here's another effective way of knowing whether your pooch is healthy or not. A dog that is using the restroom too much or too little might indicate the dog has a problem. You must pay attention to your pet's bathroom routine and any noticeable change must be taken seriously. Your dog is very healthy if her urine has a clear yellow color and her poop should be brown and firm. Scientists have confirmed that watery, bloody stools are signs of illness. If your pet is also straining to handle her business, then you need to take her to see a doctor. Small pellet-like poop might signify that she is dehydrated. This should be taken seriously as well, because Bella might be having problems with her liver, gallbladder, pancreas. Energy Levels Dogs have so much energy to burn. It's one of the reasons why we love them so much, because they always want to play and there are no dull moments. If your dog is like mine and is always up and about, then a drop in her energy level shows that something is not right. Except if she's tired. My pooch always has a thousand activities she wants to do at the same time. It's normal for your dog to go crazy when you get home, jump from chair to chair, or twirl in a circle while chasing her tail. This is not to say that Bella will not have some off days once in a while, but if this goes on for too long, then it's a sign for help. Your hound might not be yourself because of an infection, heart, or liver problem and needs immediate medical care. However, this sign is also relative. Some canines are quite laid back and calm throughout the day, while older dogs mostly just want to sleep and do not have as much energy. Should your dog belong to any of these categories, then her energy level isn't a problem. Good appetite. It's no secret that canines love food. Their love for food has also birthed a debate about what they like best, eating or spending time with their owners. A sudden drop in your pooch's appetite signifies several things. It could be a sign of significant illness, such as cancer, kidney failure, or a liver problem. This could also mean that your pet is suffering from various systematic infections. Dr. Gregory Spikes of the North Carolina Veterinary Medical Board states that what you might need to do is change her dry food brand, add broth to her food, hand feed her, or prepare her favorite meal. If any of these don't work, then she needs professional help. A very healthy dog is one that simply can't get enough. And if you have a routine, she would even remind you when you delay her meal. Make sure your hound has a diet that contains the essential nutrients she needs. Absence of lumps and bumps. Not all lumps or bumps you notice on your pet signify that something is wrong. But when you notice something, it's worth checking out. Experts recommend you run your hand along your furry friend's back from time to time to check if there are no bumps. Do this for her legs and around her stomach and other delicate parts as well. If there are no bumps, then Bella is very healthy. But should you notice anything, it might not necessarily be a problem either. Press the lump gently and see how your pooch responds. If she's in pain, talk to your vet. Other times, what you need to do is wait for some days and check the bump again. If it's bigger or bothering your dog, then it needs medical care. It's best to consult your vet about any lumps just to be sure your dog isn't in pain. Pulse The heartbeat of a dog is relative to its size. Puppies and smaller dogs' hearts beat faster, while a larger dog's heart beats slower. You can check Bella's heartbeat by placing your hand on the left side of her chest and check for the place where you can feel the strongest beat. If you feel that your canine's heart has an irregular rhythm, do not take any chances. Take her to the vet immediately to be sure there is no problem. 
Research published in the Applied Animal Behavior Science Journal in 2019 shows that a normal heart beats from 50 to 130 times a minute in a resting dog. This tells you that you have a very healthy pet. Now that you know these signs, is your dog in good health? Tell me in the comments. See you next time.